This is one that happened during the COVID period. I mean, a lot of odd things happened then, but this is one that I don't know, I, I think I'll remember for a long time. One of the things that I noticed here in Amsterdam is that, of course, th there are very few people on the streets. Uh, all the shops are shut except for the supermarkets. So everything is really dialed down to sort of one, you know. Um, and of course, there are no tourists. And because there are no tourists, there are not so many people walking around dropping bits and pieces of food. And that means the, a lot of birds, pigeons, seagulls and other birds didn't have this free lunch, this perpetual free lunch. So there were very, very few birds. And I, I just noticed there weren't many birds. It wasn't a big deal, but I just picked up on that. So one day I go down to, um, or go through Western Park and I go to this place called Praxis. It's a DIY store. And at the time you had to sort of book an appointment. You needed to get stuff to fix something in your house then you needed to book an appointment and you'd have a time slot and you'd go there and you'd do your transaction and you'd leave with whatever. And so I'm coming back and along Harlem Dyke, so just after Harlem Plain, along Harlem Dyke, I'm cycling and this a blackbird, I don't know if it was a blackbird or a crow, it was black, and it's flying kind of slowly. I'm cycling reasonably fast because the road is completely empty. And it's just flying next to me, just slightly in front. And I'm thinking, this is very strange, what is it doing? And of course, in my head, I imagine that the bird is trying to tell me something. And in the fictitious version of this, it would then actually communicate with me and lead me off on some incredible adventure. Of course, that didn't happen. But it was just quite a buzz to be cycling, and this bird is just flying, and eventually it sort of accelerated and took off but I'd never seen I hadn't noticed any birds flying on the street so low and it was just a sign of the times there was so little there were so many so few obstacles it was reasonably safe for these birds to just come down and do their thing and I again was lucky and I experienced this bird just flying like that so yeah that was that one